Hey guys, welcome back to Dragon Age Legendary Edition. If you missed the last episode, we uh, attacked the uh, Cerebus base on the Kronos Station. And I believe now all it is to do is to go to Earth. So, let us launch what I think is our final mission. We don't need any fuel. Is there anything in here? No. Okay. Order fleets to Earth. Let's go. Damn, look at that thing. Commander, you've got a priority message from Admiral Hackett requesting to come aboard. Permission granted. Aye, Commander. Oh, he does actually exist. He's an actual real person. Commander? Admiral? Are you ready to bring the might of the galaxy to bear on the Reapers? Yes, sir. Then let's make sure the fleets are ready. Hell yeah, let's do this. All fleets reporting in, sir. Never before have so many come together from all quarters of the galaxy. But never before have we faced an enemy such as this. The Reapers will show us no mercy. We must give them no quarter. They will yeah. terrorize our populations. We must stand fast in the face of that terror. They will advance until our last city falls. But we will not fall. We will prevail. Each of us will be defined by our actions in the coming battle. Stand fast. Stand strong. Stand together. Pack it out. Shepard, the sword fleets are ready to strike at the Reapers surrounding Earth. While they keep the enemy engaged, you and Hammer Ground Forces can take London. London? Why aren't we hitting the Citadel directly? Anderson can brief you on that. Great. Admiral, how are you holding up? We are ready to end this. But as you can see, the station's closed itself since it appeared over London. Damn it. Gotta get the arms open to Dr. Crucible. Exactly. But London is surrounded by Hades cannons. Hammer transports can't land while they're active. You lead a squadron of smaller shuttles. Infiltrate with a ground team to take out the cannons using heavy weapons. Hammer can land, and we'll set up a forward operation space. I still don't see how we're getting to the Citadel from London. The Reapers use this beam to transport humans, alive and dead, to the Citadel. From the FOB, Hammer will launch an all-out assault on the Citadel beam. Everyone who makes it that far will take the beam to the Citadel, then locate and activate the Citadel arm controls. Once we see those arms, Shield Fleet will escort the Crucible to the Citadel. But timing will be critical. We don't have enough firepower to keep the Crucible safe for long. Great. Um, this is what we train for. Nothing's ever easy. No reason it should start now. It's desperate. I don't even want to guess at our odds. But... But this is the only plan we have. If we wait, the Reapers bleed us slowly. Conventionally, we can't defeat the Reapers without the Crucible. Get the Citadel arms open. Commander, whatever the cost, we'll do the rest. Yes, sir. Yes, boss. Good luck to all of us. All right. Caden and Garrus, it has to be. The original OG team. Oh, I think I'm happy with all of this. Yeah. Caden, we need to fix some of your stuff. Resacracy, okay. Oh, I'm pissing, yeah. Um, damage. Magazine size. That'd be helpful. Yep. Garrus. You're kitted out. Good. 
<laughs> three points, none there. I'm just going to auto-level them up, why not? Do the same with you. Okay. Approaching Sol Relay, Commander. We're through the relay in 30 seconds. Right, let's do this. Final attack on Earth. Let's go mess up some Reapers. Look at all these ships. Alliance They've got an actual army. Turian fleet reporting. Asari fleet's reporting. Who are they? Why do I recognize those ships? Quarian fleets are coming. Quarian. Death fleet reporting. All fleets reporting in, Commander. Ready to engage on your command. All right. Jeez, there are a lot of ships. Okay. This is it, everyone. Be ready on my signal. Fire! That was the quickest signal I've ever seen. Well, here we go. On my command, engage the Reaper forces. Yes, boss. All fighters on me. Keep going. This doesn't quite have that big fight feel that number two had for the final mission. It's got this epic scale, obviously, but it doesn't have that like big fight feel. I don't know why. But like, cinematically, this looks amazing. Okay. What a gun. Breaking off. Preparing for descent. Get me in the fight. That's it, Joker. Get me in there. Let's go. Nice. Shepard. Good luck. You too, Joker. Give the man a hug. He's like our best friend on this ship, minus Garrus. All right, Cortez. Advanced teams are away. Hammer's in position and waiting for you guys to clear a path. Normandy's rejoining Sword. Stay safe. I'll be back before you know it. I'll hold you to that. Normandy out. We're closing in on the LZ, Commander. How's it look? Like hell? Take a look for yourself. <laughs> of course it looks like hell. Jeez.
Just like a Warhammer gaming top. That can't be Earth. Hold on. All right, holding on. Well, Damage. that went well. Status. That was the squad responsible for taking out that defense turret. Who's on it now? Nobody in the vicinity. All either deployed or shot down. Drop us off. Sir? We have to take that thing out before Hammer can land. Understood. Change of plans, people. We're gonna take out that Hades cannon. Great. How? Huh. That down shuttle would have been carrying heavy weapons. Perfect. You heard the man. Once we're clear, make your way to the crash shuttle. We'll search the wreckage for heavy weapons. I'm right with you. All right. Oh wow. Now, go, go. They just run a fucking grenade in here. Jeez. Cool. All right, everyone. Let's move. Okay, there we go. It's my pistol. It is. Nice. I love this gun. Anyone around here? No. Jeez. Let's go. Where are you? There you are. Push, push, push. Man, if only London didn't look like this in person. Who is Johnson? Oh, of course we do. Why wouldn't we? Come on, squad. Oh, here's Garrus. What weapon is everyone using, actually? Actually, actually, actually. He's using a sniper stick. Good. Cool. Come on. Nice. Come on. Don't do your little stupid roll. Come on. Where's this brute they keep talking about? Oh. There you go, save the day, mate. Aren't you welcome? This vibrating camera is hurting my eyes at this time in the morning. <laughs> Jeez. I need to get the better ammo, where is it? No, nope. there it is. Okay. There it is. Please don't hurt me. Excellent. Man, there are so many Reapers. Damn it, you got airborne hostiles inbound. Gonna try to keep them off you. Okay. Please don't die. What the hell? Man. God damn it. There's the shuttle. Keep an eye out for the heavy weapon supplies. What is that? <laughs> oh, cool. 
Come on. Don't run away. What are those sound effects? We should have bought Javik. No, Jim. I like uh, Gareth and Caden. This is very much our squad. Nothing there, okay. Take the med kit. Anything? Oh. That's it! Fire that thing right down its throat! Okay. Did that do anything? I can't tell. Oh, shit. Well, okay. That's it. Last gun down. All hammer teams, prepare for landing. Cool. Anybody, come in. We need extraction. Well, we got a long old walk. Come on, where's my gun? Where's my gun? Quickly, come on. Awesome. This is Commander Shepard. Any aligned personnel in the vicinity? Oh, God. Jeez. We good? Cheers, Garrus. We are just. Not doing very well here, are we? We are so just getting ambushed. Where are they coming from? Oh, down there. Got ya. Cool. Cheers. Watch this ship now blow up as well. Get in, get in, get in. Cheers, Garrus. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Get us out of here, Corporal. You okay? I'm alive. That you are, Commander. Anderson. I knew you wouldn't let me down, Shepard. I appreciate the trust. <laughs> I think you've earned it. How are we looking? Now that the heavy air defenses are dealt with, Hammer can land. And not a moment too soon. What's left of the Resistance is holding a forward operating base, but the Reapers are countering already. Once we regroup, it's going to be up to Hammer to take up the fight. Okay. <laughs> sick, sick, sick. It must have been brutal here. Cut off from the rest of the Alliance. It's been touch and go from day one. But once we figured out the Reapers were focusing on the major centers, it became easier to avoid direct contact. Until London. Yeah. We held back as long as we could, sending in recon teams. Lost a lot of good men planning this attack. But with soldiers like Major Coates, and knowing you'd bring us help, we held on. Without you and your resistance, we'd be dead in the water. Yeah, the Admiral's being modest. He's the reason any of us are still alive. Let's not start handing out medals just yet. This fight's just getting started. And Hammer better be ready for it. They didn't start out together, but they're ready to stand side by side and win this war. Good. That's what it's gonna take. We'll get it done, Anderson. Yes, we will. Born in London. Really? The entire galaxy united. Too bad it took the Reapers to bring us together. Shepard's the one that brought them together. That's exactly what I meant. I know you didn't like leaving Shepard. You tell him, Garrus. But nobody could have accomplished what you've done. It's good to be back home. There's the FOB. 
Looks good. Give Hammer the all clear. We got this team. We got this. Oh, he did not do a good job there, did he? Damn. We are dropping like flies. Nice. We actually have like a proper little army. Right, let's do this. Admiral, we've set up a command center in the building over there. Looks like we've still got groups coming in. Yes, sir, but not as many as we'd hoped. Hmm. Come see me when you're ready, Shepard. Will do. He's right. I thought there'd be more of Hamry here by now. A lot of them won't be making it. I'm sorry about Lieutenant Cortez. He was a damn good pilot. You two go on ahead. I'll catch up. Well, okay then. The fighting here has been some of the worst on the planet. It looks bad, but there's still hope. And you're here. It'll do the troops good to see you. Bolster their resolve. I'm just a soldier like them. You might see yourself like that, but they don't. Like it or not, Commander, you're a hero to these men and women. Don't discount the effect that can have on them. I better go meet up with my battalion. I'll see you at the command center. Alrighty. Right. Anything up here? No. Cool. Well, I guess we're leaving. Come on. Thank you. Nice. Where are we going? All the way up here. Damn, look at all of this. We've got a red telephone box. Oh, I'm not meant to go that way. Got ya. Nice of you to uh, clarify that. What's in here? Anything? Communications talk. Yes, Commander. Tech, sorry. Is there someone you'd like to reach? Miranda Lawson. Certainly. I'll connect you now. Shepard, good to see you. Hope you don't mind me crashing this little party of yours. Not at all. Feeling better? Much. Got a few sideways looks from Alliance Brass when I offered to help. They can't be choosy at this point. I'm glad you made it. Shepard. I wanted to say goodbye. What do you mean? If we both come back from this at all, everything will be different. Sure, everything will change. But on our terms, we've been running until now, Miranda. It has to stop. I understand. I just... wish I was there. With you. Me too. I don't know what to say. Don't say goodbye. Then finish this, Shepard. And find me. I will. I promise. Is that it? I guess so. Is there someone else I can connect you to? Um. Oh god, there's loads of people. Sure, we'll speak to everyone. Certainly. I'll connect you now. About time you got here, Shepard. I didn't want to win this thing all by myself. <laughs> Good to see you back in action, Grunt. Wouldn't miss it. 
Shepard. Yeah. Thanks for getting me out of that tank. Sure, Grunt. It's been an honor. Same here, Shepard. Okay. Grunt out. That was a nice goodbye to Miranda. I can connect you to? Jacob Taylor. Certainly. I'll connect you now. Shepard, that you? Jacob, holding up? <laughs> Kicking ass more like. My kill count's through the roof. We'll meet and compare notches when this is over. You got it. There's this, uh, great little bar in Rio we have to check out. I'm holding you to that. Give him hell, Jacob. Yes, sir. Give them Shout hell. Is there someone else I can connect you to? Zaid Masani. Certainly. I'll connect you now. Almost thought you weren't gonna make it, Shepard. Glad I was wrong. You doing okay, Zaid? Yeah, yeah. Hope you've got one hell of a speech to get everyone moving. Looks like we might need it. Never seen anything like this. We don't stop it now. It gets worse. No kidding. Just doesn't feel like a real ground war when your opponents are taller than goddamn skyscrapers. <laughs> Still, no use talking about it. Ready to go when you are. Let's cut the bastards. Hell yes. Is there someone else I can connect you to? Jack. Certainly. I'll connect you now. Just any Jack. Shepard? Shepard, is that you? Jack, how are you guys? Good so far. We're away south of your position. We saved some resistance fighters with barrier support. Bringing a bit more firepower your way. I'll see you on the other side. I won't let you down, Shepard. Go kick some ass. You too. Is there someone else I can connect you to? Kasumi. Kasumi Goto. Certainly. I'll connect you now. Hey, Shep. You ready down there? Depends hey, on whether you got the crucible good to go. Oh, it's ready. No idea what it'll do exactly, but it's gonna be big. Good luck, Shepard. If you live through it, drinks are on me. Sounds perfect. Is there someone else I can connect you to? Samara. Certainly. I'll connect you now. I wondered if I'd see you again, Samara. It's past time I joined your battle. You helped me a great deal in the monastery, Shepard. Thank you for returning the favor. Only your actions will be remembered. May you choose them well. Farewell. <laughs> no pressure with that one. Is there someone else I can connect you to? I'm done. Yes, sir. All right. Well, that was nice. Let's go speak to Anderson. I assume he's in here. Or not. How do I get to this dude? Oh, what's up here? What is up here? Okay. I thought someone just did a backflip, but they didn't. I want you to coordinate with the Alliance. Make sure we iron out these logistical problems. Garrus. Oh, it's Vitus. I didn't realize you were here. I wanted to return the favor in person. Though I'm sorry to see your world. Looks as bad as ours. Cheers, mate. It's a shame. Shepard. So I guess this is... Just like old times? <laughs> huh. Be the last chance we get to say that. Think we're gonna lose? No, I think we're about to kick the Reapers back into whatever black hole they crawled out of. Then we're going to retire somewhere warm and tropical and live off the royalties from the vids. <laughs> I'll meet you there. I think my days of saving the galaxy are over when this is done. Be sure to leave room for all the autographs. <laughs> Just need to beat the Reapers to get there. James told me there's an old saying here on Earth. May you be in heaven half an hour before the devil knows you're dead. Not sure if Torian heaven is the same as yours, but 
this thing goes sideways and we both end up there, meet me at the bar. I'm by. Shepard and Vicarian storming heaven. I guess there were worse ways this could end. But maybe some other day. And Shepard, forgive the insubordination, but this old friend has an order for you. Go out there and give them hell. You were born to do this. Goodbye, Garrus. And if I'm up there in that bar and you're not, I'll be looking down. I'll always have your back. Mm, isn't that nice? Well, okay then. We've got hostiles on the perimeter. Of course we do. Get on that gun. All right. Time to save the day again. Oh, it's this gun again. My favorite. Miss. Now is not the time to overheat. God damn it. Cool. Miss. Cool. Come on. You have to be kidding me. Where are they all coming from? What the hell? Hey, I guess we did it. Cool. Oh, Liara. What are you doing here? in many more wounded that's something how are you holding up Liara this is it isn't it yeah this is it I don't know what to say I just know I'll have a clever line five minutes from now <laughs> I do have one thing for you Shepard a gift It'll only take a moment, if you want it. Absolutely. Sure. I've got a moment. Close your eyes. Mm, boy, here we go. that Mass Effect like menu music which is so good. Who is that talking? Javik! Commander. Was it this bad in your time? Worse. I have been listening to the Krogan speak to his men. In our cycle, the races never came together. There was no rallying cry. I envy you. Really? There's not much left out there. The future is still out there. It is something my people could never say. There will be a tomorrow. Only if we win today. No one else has ever made it this far. You came a long way, Javik. Further than anyone else here. And I look forward to fulfilling my mission. 
But you are now the avatar of this cycle, the exemplar of victory. Not just for humanity, or Turians, or Protheans, but for all life. Every soul that has ever existed is watching this moment. Well, no pressure when you put it that way. I was just about to say that, Shepard. Victory is never won without difficult choices. <laughs> Ain't that the truth? I know. I've had to make a lot of those. There may be more. But I know you will see this through for all of us. No matter the cost. If we actually pull this off, what'll you do afterwards? Since my birth, life's only pursuit has been war. I look forward to seeing what peace looks like. It's a big galaxy. I believe the Hanar would welcome me. I could live like a king among them. Thank you, <laughs> Commander, for letting the last voice of the Protheans speak. It has been a privilege. The honor has been all mine, buddy. Shepard, you did it. No matter what else happens today, you did what no one else could. You united a galaxy. That's a victory right there. And don't worry. I know why you're going to win. Because you brought the Krogan. Now let's go kick some ass, Shepard. I meant to tell you, Shepard. Yes, boss. Earth reminds me of home. Guess you'll be needing a new planet, too. Where are we That's going? Okay. Oh. What about this, though? We could circle around and flood it with reinforcements. Edie, Anderson, Halley. Where's Caden? Uh, Edie. Shepard, I have a question. Is it a big or small one? It is important. Its relevance would be diminished at any other time. Ask away. In this battle, the Reapers have no reason not to use their full capabilities to destroy us. Their forces are in entrenched positions. They have superior firepower and outnumber our forces. My question is, what makes you think we can reach the Conduit at all? The Reapers have the Citadel. They think they've won, and that's the best time to hit them. If they have spies or other intelligence, we could lose the element of surprise. In such a case, we will likely lose. Are you afraid? Our probability for success is greater than any other plan presented to date. That's not what I asked. Are you afraid? I do not understand the purpose of the question. There's no room for doubt anymore, Edie. You understand what we have to do, or you don't. I am clear on what we must accomplish, Shepard. The Reapers have destroyed thousands of civilizations. Then let's go kick their ass. never destroyed ours. Nor will they. Couldn't have put it better myself. Time to move out. Shepard, there is something I want you to know. Okay. The of man ordered my creation years ago. Jeff was the one who allowed me to think for myself. But only now do I feel alive. That is your influence. Thanks, Edie. All right. Tally? Almost time for the final push. Are you okay? I thought I'd be asking you that question. Shepard, I backed you when I was just a kid on her pilgrimage. I backed you when the Normandy was a Cerberus ship. What kind of friend would I be if I didn't back you now? And you haven't answered my question. Are you okay? You remember how you felt when you landed on Rannoch? Now imagine it's not a story passed down by your people. Imagine you were there just a few months ago. And now you're seeing it like this. We need to put it right. We will. Whatever happens, I'm proud to have served with you, Captain. It's been an honor, Tally Zoravas Normandy. The Admirals once hung that ship name on me like a badge of shame. And then the Normandy helped us reclaim our homeworld. It's time I returned the favor. Let's do this. Commander? Admiral? Just going over the sit rep. How's it look? Barely 50% of Hammer has reported in. Can we count on more making it? There's some stragglers still en route. 
but the bulk of hammer that's still intact has arrived. We're as ready as we're likely to get. I mean, it's a pretty solid stop. <laughs> um, yeah, let's do this. Every minute wasted here, the Reapers gather strength. Exactly my thoughts. Battalion leaders, report to HQ. We fought hard to get here, but now the toughest part of our mission begins. We've got to drive right through the heart of Reaper-controlled territory, break past their defenses, and get to that beam. What kind of defenses? The entire area is crawling with Reaper forces. But our biggest concern is the destroyer, protecting the beam itself. Can we bring in air support to deal with it? Negative. Some kind of interference. We'll have to take it out from the ground. Now they've cut a swath of no man's land through the city. We'll have to cross that first. There'll be some limited shelter on the other side, but expect heavy ground resistance. We need to get our tanks to here, if we get close enough. We've got a shot at taking that thing out. How much of a shot? They know we're coming. This will be a one-way trip for many of us, but there can be no right. retreat. No stepping back. We move forward at all costs, understood? Oh yeah. Yes, sir. Johnson, Coates, you two will coordinate the artillery units. Do you love a one-way trip? Shepard, I'm sending you right up the gut where the resistance is heaviest. Support the tanks the best you can, but stay alive. I need you for the final push to the beam. All right. I'll give you a minute with your squad. Pick your team well. Same team as always. I say always as before. Come on. Oh, here we go. <laughs> Comrades. Uh... This war has brought us pain and suffering and loss. But it's also brought us together as soldiers, allies, friends. This bond that ties us together is something the Reapers will never understand. It's more powerful than any weapon, stronger than any ship. It can't be taken or destroyed. Yeah, remember what you fight for. The next few hours will decide the fate of everyone in the galaxy. Every mother, every son, every unborn child. They're trusting you, depending on you to win them their future. A future free from the threat of the Reapers. But take heart, look around you. You're not in this fight alone. We face our enemy together, and together we will defeat them. Let's go kick some ass. Here we go. Alright, I'm happy with all of this. Right, let's go. So many husks. Damn. Nice. You know, when we win this war, the infrastructure of this entire like planet is going to have to be rebuilt. Right, what are we looking at here? I need to get my ammo back. There we go. Nice. 
good? I think we are. Oh, because they're there. Cool. Come on, jump through. No man's land. Alright, let's go. Oh no. Got them marauders. Nice. Come on. Got ya. Got you as well. Fuck ton of damage. Oh no. Oh, there's not someone there. Come on. Nice. Quickly, come on. Awesome. What building? Oh. Alright. Clear out the Reaper stronghold. I'm working on it. Ain't exactly... What the hell was that? Of course. Oh, there's two of them. That's cool. Sweet. Excellent stuff. They're at the rest of the building then, I guess. I'm working on it. Don't pressure me. Can you just relax? Okay. Ooh. Oh, that door doesn't open. All I saw was mum and dad, and we're not even going to attempt to read that. It's just going to be sad. We'll grab that. Okay. Oh, shoot. Cool. <laughs> All right, people. Eyes peeled. The buildings will give us some cover, but it gives them a place to hide. Roger that. Yep. Down we go. Oh man, come on. I love how they just put red telephone boxes everywhere, so you know it's London. <laughs> Oh, I see you. What is it? Oh, it's a marauder. Nice. Oh, of course, there's a brute. Why would there not be? Come on. There are so many. What is that sound? Cool. Where are they all coming from? Great. Just great.
Good. Good, good, good. Alright, so we, we're starting to make it across no man's land, that's good. This team. Okay. Awesome. We're getting closer. Yeah, please don't. Oh. Okay, I did not see them in here. Who shoot me? Oh. Fuck you. God damn. I cannot. Great news. That's it, come on. Nice. Well, this is promising, isn't it? I can hear what sounds like another brute. Come on. Yep. So this plan isn't going that well, is it, people? Not going that well at all. Alright, come on, squad. Yeah, come on. That did nothing. Sick. Where's our fire support? We need reinforcements on them. Oh boy. There, everyone is dying now. There's the artillery, but the company's been wiped out. Commander, do you read me? Major, what's the situation? The beam's interfering with missile guidance. We can hit the destroyer, but we'll never make the precision strike we need to take it out. Damn it. Edie, can you read me? Yes, Commander. Any suggestions? I may be able to use the Normandy systems to enhance the missile's targeting capabilities. Excellent. I'll need you to open a link to the Normandy from the missile systems. On it. Okay, where do I do that? On this one, got ya. Cool, let's go. That's it. I'll let you know when I've adapted the targeting systems. Sounds like good news, Commander. We'll see. Hammer, this is Admiral Anderson. The Reaper ground forces are making a push. Hold your ground. Protect those tanks until we can get a shot. You heard it, people. Get ready. There they are! Where? What the hell was that noise? Oh boy. 
Here we go. Man, come on. That's it, Gareth. You do your little roll. I'm here to support. Who do we have? There you are. God damn, they are everywhere. Cool. Is that it? It's saving. Banshee, it is. Sick. Sick, sick, sick. Cool. Got ya. Come on. Oh man, there's another one. Come on. Come on. Nice. These things are just killing us. Come on. No ammo. Oh, no. Come on. Okay. Any more? Please. Let's get these things gone. Missile guidance enhanced. Firing. Countering interference. Did it hit? What happened? The Reaper is still too close to the beam. We're down to two missiles. And we haven't even scratched it. You will need to allow the Reaper to move out of the beam's influence. And closer to us. Commander, hammer's being overrun at every turn. Reaper ground forces are converging on your location. We're fighting our way to you. Hold on, Commander. Hold on. Another wave incoming. Hold on, everyone. We can do this. Let's hope so. Here they come. Great. Oh, boy. Cool. They are everywhere. Okay. Oh, Garrus. Where is first aid? How did you go down? Where are you? Oh, shoot. That's how you went down. Got ya. Got you, mate. Got you, got you. Oh, no. <laughs> okay. Great. More worried about the brutes, to be honest, buddy. Oh, what the shit. Oh, no. Come on. Come on. There we go. There more. God damn it, there is. Where are they? Come on. Quickly, come on. Cool. Shit in hell. Cool. 
pay them. Oh, shoot. Shit. Got ya. Let's. Okay. Is that another banshee I hit? Oh my god. It is. Jesus Christ. They are just overrunning us. We have no shields, nothing. Come on. Come on. Nice, 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 nice. Cool. Come on, team. Where, 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 where? Let's go, let's go, let's go. Come on. Hit it. Cheers, Garrus. Damn. That is a powerful gun. Hell yeah. Destroyer terminated. Nice work, Edie. Jeopard. We're on our way to your location. Right. About damn time. Jeopard. Over here. Thank God you made it. It didn't look good. It gets worse. Of course it does. Hackett just reported in. Several Sovereign class Reapers, including Harbinger, have broken off from the battle with Sword. They're headed here. <laughs> of course. Harbinger. It's an opportunity for Hackett to get the Crucible in place. But we have to get a team on board the Citadel to open those arms now. We still don't even know what we'll find when we get to the Citadel. Now that's our job. Find out what we're up against. All right. Saddle up, everybody. Get me Admiral Hackett. All right. Acknowledge. I'll send the word. All ships, this is Admiral Hackett. The Crucible is on the move. I repeat, the Crucible is on the move. All right, let's get it in place. Protect it at all costs. Everyone, this is it. Look at that. Any available squadrons, delay those Reapers leaving the battle. We've got to give Hammer more time. From here on in, it's a straight shot to the beat. A straight shot with Reapers trying to crush us along the way. We just need to get a handful of troops through. Only a handful, huh? We knew this was going to be a gamble at best. Yes, we did. Can't think of anyone else I'd rather do this with. Nobody's doing this alone. 
No, we ain't. We're in sight of the target. All right, everyone. This is it. Well, that sounds promising. Shit. Shit indeed. Oh, no. <laughs> that thing's we massive. Well, out of the frying pan into the fire. Come on. Jeez. Well, at least my team are with me. He got wiped out. Damn. To be honest, because we make good shield. Oh boy. Well, Jesus. Real good. Do you copy? I need an evac right now. Alright. Get on. the guys out here. Here. Take him. Check him. Gotta get out of here. And you've gotta be kidding me. Don't argue, Garrus. We're in this to the end. I need to know somebody's getting out of this alive. Just make damn sure that includes you two. You always want the best shot. Not by half. Take care, Garrus. And then it was just me. Yep, now it is just me. Oh, the normally better escape. Imagine if we put him on the plane and then it blows up. Come on, we are so close. Oh, we're still up. <laughs> Fuck yeah, we are. Come on then, Shepard. This. Oh, God. Cool. Oh, man. Come on. Push forward, dude. Come on, we are so close. Oh. Oh no, come on, aim. There we go. Why would you make me aim? In this state, come on. That's it. Come on now.
Oh, what is going on now? Yep, crush that. this well that's not going to do us any good Shepard. do I have Shepard. a gun still uh. Anderson you up here too Yeah, we're just surrounded by death. I'm in a dark hallway. Reminds me of your description of the collector base. <clears throat> Makes sense. You think they're making a reaper in here? Oh, sure. They <laughs> round them up on Earth, then send the people up here to be processed. I agree. But where the hell are we? Yeah. It doesn't look like any part of the Citadel I've been to. I mean, this could be any part of the Citadel that they've just changed. Anderson. Are we on the citadel? Like, like literally on it. I see something up ahead. Might be a way to cross over. Don't get too far ahead of me. <laughs> we are struggling. Where do you think you're at? Just found that chasm we were talking about. Hold on. I see something. A control panel, maybe. I'm just gonna go on. Anderson. God damn it, Anderson. Damn it. Dude, this is a steep slope for us to be climbing up in this state. I've walked up hills smaller than this that have tied me out. And this dude's just dragging himself up here. Oh, Anderson, please. Look at this. Yes, Anderson. <laughs> we Anderson. do not look good. Oh, no. Shepard! I can't! I underestimated you, Shepard. 
Oh, what? What? I warned you. Control is the means to survival. Control of the Reapers and of you, if necessary. Mm. They're controlling you. I don't think so, Admiral. Controlling me is a lot different than controlling a Reaper. Have a little faith. <laughs> when humanity discovered the mass relays, when we learned there was more to the galaxy than we imagined, there were some who thought the relays should be destroyed. They were scared of what we'd find, terrified of what we might let in. But look at what humanity has achieved. Since that discovery, we've advanced more than the past 10,000 years combined. And the Reapers will do the same for us again, a thousandfold. But... <sighs> Only if we can harness their ability to control. Bullshit. Oh no. We destroy them. Or they destroy us. And waste this opportunity? Never. You're playing with things you don't understand. With power you shouldn't be able to use. I... don't believe that. If we can control it, why shouldn't it be ours? Because... we're not ready. No. This is the way humanity must evolve. There's always another way. I've dedicated my life to understanding the Reapers, and I know with certainty the Crucible will allow me to control them. His eyes are cool. And then what? Look at the power they wield. Look at what they can do. Oh no. I see what they did to you. I took what I wanted from them, made it my own. This isn't about me or you. It's about things so much bigger than all of us. He's wrong. Don't listen to him. And who will you listen to, Shepard? An old soldier stuck in his ways, only able to see the world down the barrel of a gun? And what if he's wrong? What if controlling the Reapers is the answer? <sighs> yeah, so, uh, yeah, and what if you're wrong? If we destroy the Reapers, this ends today. But if you can't control them... But I can! Are you willing to bet humanity's existence on it? I know it will work. You can't, can you? They won't let you do it. No! I'm in control! No one is telling me what to do! Listen to yourself! You're indoctrinated. No! No! The two of you so self-righteous. Do you think power like this comes easy? There are sacrifices. You've sacrificed too much. Shepard, I... I only wanted to protect humanity. The Crucibles can control them. I know it can. I just... <laughs> it's not too late. Let us go. We'll do the rest. I... Uh, I can't do that, Commander. Of course you can't. They own you now. You... You'd undo everything I've accomplished. Oh, no. I won't let that happen. Because of you, humanity is already undone. That's not true! They have the Citadel. They've got us fighting each other, instead of fighting them. I just need to... You've done exactly what the Reapers wanted. You're still doing it because they control you. I... They're too strong. You're stronger. Don't let them win. Break their hold. Don't let them control you. I tried. 
Shepherd. Well, okay then. That's one way to solve that problem. Is Anderson all right? You're not going to check on him? I guess not. Right. Let's end this. Nice. This is it, everyone. The arms are opening. Come so far. Get plugged in. That's it. The crucible is docked. Let's hope this does something. <sighs> Still alive? We did it. Yes, we did. It's uh, quite a view. <laughs> Best seats in the house. God. Feels like years since I just sat down. I think you earned a rest. Anderson? Mm. Mm. Stay with me. We're almost through this. You did good, son. You did good. I'm proud of you. Thank you, sir. Anderson? Man, I was really hoping he'd survive. Shepherd. Guess not. Commander. Hey. What do you need me to do? Nothing's happening. The crucible's not firing. Right. Great. <laughs> I don't see. I'm not sure how to. Commander. Oh man. Oh. Where are we going? <laughs> what is going on here? Okay. What is happening? I'm so confused. So confused. I was that little kid. Wake up. Where am I? 
The Citadel. It's my home. Who are you? I am the Catalyst. No way. The Citadel was the Catalyst. No. The Citadel is part of me. I need to stop the Reapers. Do you know how I can do that? Perhaps. I control the Reapers. They are my solution. Oh my god, we've been chasing the kid in our dreams. We've been chasing the Catalyst. Solution? To what? Chaos. <laughs> Great answer, cool. The created will always rebel against their creators. But we, we found, found a way to stop that from happening. A way to restore order. By wiping out organic life? No, we harvest advanced civilizations, leaving the younger ones alone. Just as we left your people alive the last time we were here. But you killed the rest. We helped them ascend, so they could make way for new life, storing the old life in Reaper form. I think we'd rather keep our own form. No, you can't. Without us to stop it, synthetics would destroy all organics. We've created the cycle so that never happens. That's the solution. What? You said you're the catalyst. What are you? A construct. An intelligence designed eons ago to solve a problem. I was created to bring balance. To be the catalyst for peace between organics and synthetics. So you're just an AI? In as much as you are just an animal, I embody the collective intelligence of all Reapers. But you were created. Correct. By who? By ones who recognized that conflict would always arise between synthetics and organics. I was first created to oversee the relations between synthetic and organic life. To establish a connection. But our efforts always ended in conflict, so a new solution was required. The Reapers? Precisely. Right. I met your creators. They told me what you did to them. We did as we were expected. They said you betrayed them, that you turned them into Harbinger. When they asked that I solve the problem of conflict, they failed to understand they were part of the problem themselves. The flaws of their organic reasoning could not perceive this. They lacked the foresight to understand their destruction was part of the very solution they required. Well, they've joined this war now. And I welcome their involvement. I am only facilitating their request. Okay, I mean, I guess that makes sense. Where did the Reapers come from? Did you create them? My creators gave them form. I gave them function. They, in turn, give me purpose. The Reapers are a synthetic representation of my creators. Leviathan. Yes. They created me to oversee the relations between synthetic and organic life. To establish a connection. They became the first true Reaper. They did not approve. But it was the only solution. You said that before. But how do the Reapers solve anything? Organics create synthetics to improve their own existence. But those improvements have limits. To exceed those limits, synthetics must be allowed to evolve. They must, by definition, surpass their creators. The result is conflict, destruction, chaos. It is inevitable. Reapers harvest all life, organic and synthetic, preserving them before they are forever lost to this conflict. Mm, right. We're at war with the Reapers right now. You may be in conflict with the Reapers, but they are not interested in war. I find that hard to believe. When fire burns, is it at war? Is it in conflict? Or is it simply doing what it was created to do? We are no different. 
We harvest your bodies, your knowledge, your creations. We preserve it to be reborn in the form of a new reaper. Like a cleansing fire, we restore balance. Mm. New life, both organic and synthetic, can once again flourish. Crucible. What do you know about the crucible? The device you refer to as the crucible is little more than a power source. However, in combination with the citadel and the relays, it is capable of releasing tremendous amounts of energy throughout the galaxy. It is crude, but effective and adaptive in its design. Who designed it? You would not know them, and there is not enough time to explain. We first noted the concept for this device several cycles ago. With each passing cycle, the design has no doubt evolved. Why didn't you stop it? We believe the concept had been eradicated. Clearly, organics are more resourceful than we realized. Hmm. Yeah. You'll never understand us. The defining characteristic of organic life is that we think for ourselves. Make our own choices. You take that away. And we might as well be machines, just like you. You have choice. More than you know. The fact that you are standing here, the first organic ever, proves it. But it also proves my solution won't work anymore. So now what? We find a new solution. Why are you telling me this? Why help me? You have altered the variables. What do you mean? The crucible changed me, created new possibilities, but I can't make them happen. If there is to be a new solution, you must act. It is now in your power to destroy us. But be warned, others will be destroyed as well. The Crucible will not discriminate. All synthetics will be targeted. Even you are partly synthetic. Huh. Right. What exactly will happen? Your Crucible device appears to be largely intact. However, the effects of the blast will not be constrained to the Reapers. Technology you rely on will be affected, but those who survive should have little difficulty repairing the damage. There will still be losses, but no more than what has already been lost. But the Reapers will be destroyed? Yes, but the peace won't last. Soon, your children will create synthetics, and then the chaos will come back. There has to be another way. There is. You could instead use the energy of the Crucible to seize control of the Reapers. So... The elusive man was right after all. Yes, but he could never have taken control. Because we already controlled him. But I can. You will die. You will control us, but you will lose everything you have. Right. Okay. How can I control the Reapers if I'm dead? Your corporeal form will be dissolved, but your thoughts and even your memories will continue. Your connection to your kind will be lost, though you will remain aware of their existence. Okay. Um... Uh, I think I understand. But the Reapers will obey me? Yes. We will be yours to control and direct as you see fit. Hmm. There is another solution. Synthesis. And that is? Add your energy to the crucibles. The chain reaction will combine all synthetic and organic life into a new framework, a new DNA. Hmm. Hey, yeah, how? Explain how my energy can be added to the crucible. Your organic energy, the essence of who and what you are, 
will be broken down and then dispersed. To do what, exactly? The, the energy of the crucible, released in this way, will alter the matrix of all organic life in the galaxy. Organics seek perfection through technology. Synthetics seek perfection through understanding. Organics will be perfected by integrating fully with synthetic technology. Synthetics, in turn, will finally have full understanding of organics. It is the ideal solution. Now that we know it is possible, it is inevitable we will reach synthesis. Why couldn't you do it sooner? We have tried a similar solution in the past. But it has always failed. Why? Because the organics were not ready. It is not something that can be forced. You are ready, and you may choose it. Hmm. Yeah, we are. We're altering people without their choice. I don't know. Why not? Synthetics are already part of you. Can you imagine your life without them? And there will be peace? The, the cycle, cycle will end. The Reapers will cease their harvest, and the civilizations preserved in their forms will be connected to all of us. Synthesis is the final evolution of all life. The paths are open, but you have to choose. Right. Great. Great, great, great. Hmm. What do I want to do? I... Controlling them seems like a bad idea, to be honest. Let's destroy this one. Let's just kill all the Reapers. Oh, we're gonna kill a Geth though. Oh, you know what? The Corians are stupid. They're gonna remake the Geth 100%. Oh, but then there's ED. Hmm. You know what? I'm sure ED will be okay. What do I do? Do I shoot it? I guess so. Anderson. There's our waifu. All fleets, the crucible is armed. Disengage and head to the rendezvous point. I repeat, disengage and get the hell out of here. Jeff, we need to go. Sorry, Joker. That's it, boom out of here. So it all came down to this.
can't believe how massive Reapers are. Insanely big. Oh, hell yes. That's it, let's go. <laughs> nice. Well, we won. Is that the mass relay? It looks like it. Oh, it is. It's going to all of them. Oh, interesting. So we're going to have to be rebuilt. Nice team. What ship is that? It's not the Normandy, is it? Oh boy. <laughs> oh, come on, team. Please survive. Did they make it? More importantly, where are we? The SR2. I recognize this planet. How many people survived the flight? Hey, Garrus, you're looking much better. Go on, tell me the whole crew survived. I mean, this, this looks nice. It looks like the planet from number one. Yes, Kaden. What happened to everyone else? Where is everyone the else? The war is over. The Reapers have been defeated. Against all odds, and in the face of the greatest threat this galaxy has ever known, we survived. We suffered many losses. The relays are severely damaged. But we won. They're fixable though.
This victory belongs to each of us. Every man, woman, and child. Every civilization. On every world. Hey, that's Miranda. Oh, is that Samara's daughter? Of course, Kasumi has a wall safe. Now, as we take our first steps toward restoring what we lost, we must remember what it took to win. Aww, cute. This wasn't a victory by a single fleet, a single army, or even a single species. If this war has taught us anything, it is that we are at our strongest when we work together. And if we can put down our grievances long enough to stop something as powerful as the Reapers, imagine what we can achieve now that they are defeated. It will take time, but we can rebuild everything that was destroyed. Our homes, our worlds, our fleets and defenses, all of this and more. Together, we can build a future greater than any one of us could imagine. A future paid for by the sacrifices of those who fought and died alongside us. Man, a thanks. future that many will never see. I need to have Edie survive, though. Cortez is on there. Oh, Edie didn't survive. Her name's on the wall. Oh, man. And while we still have many challenges ahead of us, we can face them together. And we will honor those who died to give us that future. And what our squad's going to be up to now, then? Okay, well that looks like the end of Mass Effect Legendary Edition. This has been... A very long, very crazy wild ride. Uh, I really hope you enjoyed this series. Um, it's been a lot of fun. We're going to take a break from Mass Effect. We're not going to jump straight into Andromeda, but we are going to cover it. And who knows, maybe we'll do a Femship uh, playthrough or live streams at some point. If you've enjoyed the series, the episode, whatever, please drop the a like, guys. It helps amazingly. If you're new and you're not subscribed, but you'd like to, that'd also be amazing. And hopefully I'll see you all in whatever we do next. Bye, guys. Oh, there's more. Did that all really happen? Yes, but some of the details have been lost in time. It all happened so very long ago. When can I go to the stars? One day, my sweet. What will be there? Anything you can imagine. Our galaxy has billions of stars. Each of those stars could have many worlds. Every world could be home to a different form of life. And every life is a special story 
of its own. Tell me another story about the shepherd. It's getting late, but okay. One more story. The shepherd. Hey, we did it. A current direction is bringing an end to the Reaper threat. Command the Shepherd has become a legend, and from here you can continue to build that legend. It's been a long journey for Shepherd and for the team here at Bioware, and like Shepherd, we couldn't have done it alone. The Mass Effect trilogy began as, a vi as the vision of a small team, but over the years it has grown. The growth is fueled and shaped by the feedback and support of our player community. Thank you for joining us on this journey, and we look forward to sharing further adventures with you in the Mass Effect universe.